Hello there, today's video is going to be on really weird beauty trends that I just keep coming across. Like literally, I try to be a normal person and I just can't. Weirdness just comes my way. Give this video a thumbs up if you're a weird person and you just can't stop being weird no matter what. I've done a lot of videos in the past. If you guys are interested, I'll leave like a playlist down below of videos that you can watch that are similar to this because there's just a lot of weird things going around. And you know what? I applaud that. I applaud weird people. Make sure you guys stay connected on my Instagram and Twitter for lots of fun things. And also my vlog channel. We just hit 30,000 subscribers. I explained on my Snapchat why that was important to me. So if you care, you can just go check it out on there. But uh, without further ado, let's go on to this weird stuff. I came across this really cool Instagram account, Janine underscore Kerr underscore hair, where she does like the coolest hair things. And one of the things is actually taking stencils and basically creating designs on your hair, which I find really interesting and weird and just a cool way to accessorize your hair. So that's what I'm going to try. Curious to see if this will actually one day become a trend. I think it's super cool, super hip, super awesome. So let's try it out, super dope. So I just bought these stencils. I'm gonna try different things. And then I bought two different and then I bought two different hair dyes, which I shall try. Before doing this, I would advise you to put on a shirt that you don't really care about. First, get a color that shows up on your hair. So if you're blonde, all these are gonna show up on your hair. All right, guys, I'm gonna try this one out. You know what the worst part about doing YouTube? People will leave you comments saying you didn't try. I tried. All right, let's try it on this side. Progress. I see progress. Dang, she makes it look super easy, guys. <sighs> I applaud Janine for trying out something so different. An amateur like myself definitely cannot. Well, I mean, right, the next weird beauty hack I saw on Instagram, and I was like, what? You have to contour your toes. Girl, don't do that. It just seems like so much work, but. I'm gonna try it out. I don't really think anyone does this, honestly, but that's just weird. Let's try it out. A message to foot models. If you're a foot model, I appreciate your job. It's hard to make feet look good on camera. All right, here we go. All right, you guys, so I'm following this picture right here. My contour isn't the color of my feet. Crap. I don't see a difference here, and I don't see a difference here. So, was life? I don't know. Okay. Kinda look better on camera though. No. You guys, and if that wasn't weird enough, then things get a little weirder. I came across this beautiful picture by Iri Tandra Sana. She also has a YouTube channel, and I'm just gonna recreate this look. It's called Thermal Highlight, which, what the heck, man? Makeup? The artistry behind this absolutely beautiful. She actually has a YouTube channel on what I'm about to do exactly So I'm gonna link it down below. I think this would be really fun to do with friends to look like crazies and then go out in public and then take pictures and tweet me if you do that You are awesome. I will follow you if you do that. That is so cool. I guess she starts with all the highest points of the face where your face would typically highlight Already popping and glowing. All right now I'm gonna go in with another color. This already looks super cool. So this is the finished look. I think it looks really badass, honestly. She says in order to photograph this beautifully, you just gotta dim your brightness and then put a really strong light in front of your face. But this is awesome. And for the last weird beauty trend, I've seen tanning tattoos. Like this is like a Tumblr thing. This is like a Pinterest thing. It looks kind of cute. And then sometimes some people take it a little bit too far. I was really into this in middle school though. I never did it, but I thought it looked so cool. And I was like, oh my God, like I like, Give this video a thumbs up if you made it to the end of the video. You guys are awesome. Leave me a comment down below if you made it to the end of the video and I will reply back to you. Make sure you stay connected with me on my Instagram and Twitter because I love talking to you guys on there and my Snapchat, of course. I'm actually more active on Snapchat than anything else. And I love you guys so much. Thank you for everyone that comes up to me and says hi whenever you guys see me. I really appreciate it. A lot of you tweet me and are like, oh my God, I was too afraid to come up to you. Or when I actually see you guys in person, you guys are like, oh, I almost didn't come up and say hi to you. Please say hi to me. Trust me, I am just as nervous as you are and it makes me super happy and I smile from ear to ear Dennis knows this and if we ever see you in public like we'll catch you on the vlog and then you can also be on the vlog and I just I'm really appreciative for everyone that comes up to me and says hi it's such a rewarding feeling and it makes me the happiest girl honestly I hope you guys have an amazing day and I'll see you guys next time bye